new at noon. A local family lucky to be alive right now after their house went up in flames overnight. Investigators still on the scene right now trying to figure out what caused it. 19's Katie Tursik live in Valley City. Katie, this family, how are they holding up? Good afternoon, Nicole. They certainly are holding up. In fact, we actually just spoke to the family. Dave DiCarlo, him and his family, they live in this home. And last night, just after midnight, that is when they called 911 and they said, hey, there was a fire that is happening. They were able to get out and they were able to head into their barn. They tell me that they have lived inside of this home for 12 years. And actually, Dave DiCarlo, his wife, and then his sister, they were in the home at the time of this fire. Now, I want to take you back to last night when this just happened. So as you can see from these photos, I want you to take a look. When firefighters arrived, they found the garage attached to the home in flames. Fire officials say it took them about an hour to get the fire under control. They were able to stop the fire from spreading to the entire home. I spoke with next door neighbor, Debbie Gillen, who, as you can imagine, was surprised to wake up to this. Take a listen. So we did not know anything until we heard about it on Facebook this morning. Um, we're just thankful that they got out and, and they had no animals in the house and everybody is safe and hopefully they can rebuild and, and come back out here to us. Certainly they are going to have to rebuild this portion of the home. I had spoke to the fire chief and he said that it seems like part of the home, will, they will at least be able to keep that and it will be able to be recovered. Now on top of that, the fire chief also mentioned that they just switched to overnight staffing and they attribute them being able to get out here and respond to this fire so quickly and save this home to that overnight staffing. I'm live here in Valley City, Kay Tursek, 19 News.